Jeffrey Hudson was a little person in the 17th century, which already set him apart, but his life was absolutely bonkers. Born in 1619, Hudson was considered a marvel because although he only grew to about 18 inches, he had so-called perfect proportions. Except this only brought him heartache. When he was only seven, his own parents gifted him to their local duke as entertainment. This soon landed him in the entourage of Henrietta Maria, the Queen Consort of England. The next years of Hudson's life were full of great luxury and great humiliation. He dressed in fine clothes and even took on the Queen's Catholic religion, but he was still just a sideshow. At 25, Hudson decided he would no longer be the butt of every joke. He had every right, but it led to disaster. After yet another humiliation, he killed a powerful man in a duel and the Queen exiled him. And this led to one last brutal twist. Soon after, a slave ship captured him and he spent the next 25 years in a labor camp. Even when he returned to England, anti-Catholic sentiment landed him in prison. He died a free man, but barely. He died just two years after being freed and they buried him in a pauper's grave. 